The Atlanta Falcons have won just 3 out of 10 games this season, but still have a slim chance to make the playoffs in a muddled NFC. On Wednesday, the team returned to the practice field to begin preparation for this Sunday's game against the Las Vegas Raiders. Running back Todd Gurley knee, and tight end Hayden Hurst ankle, were both held out of practice, while Calvin Ridley foot were limited. Let's look at the full Wednesday injury report for Atlanta's Week 12 Atlanta Falcons wide receiver Julio Jones was shaken up during the first half of game against the New Orleans Saints. At one point, Jones briefly headed to the blue medical tent on the Falcons' sideline. It was unclear what Jones' issue was, but it clearly needed further evaluation. On the bright side for Atlanta, Jones wasn't in the tent long, and when he returned to the sideline, he began jogging and trying to get loose. It looks like he's at least trying to return to the game. However, when back to training, Joan was in pain and was forced to go to the hospital to check the situation, but there is no official announcement about the Jones injury. Julio Jones's absence was notable against the Saints, so it's encouraging that he was able to practice in a limited fashion to start the week as that bodes well for the upcoming matchup against the Raiders. It's possible the coaching staff has decided to give many of Atlanta's starters a lighter week this late in the season, but this is one of the fullest injury reports the Falcons have had on a Wednesday in a while.